I've said this before, and this is here's the, the okay. So I, I told you there's going to be something I'm going to tell you that's going to be really hard for a lot of guys to hear. This is it. So when a woman is having an affair, when she's in a situation where she's a guy, and it's not just a one night stand, and it's like a regular occurrence, odds are he's correct. Like he, she's probably fucking that guy because she now has not only does she like fucking him, she also has an emotional investment. She has invested herself emotionally in this guy. But she still is paired, once again, because that's the context, she's paired with her husband or she's paired with a long-term boyfriend. And now she's got to figure out how to break it off. Usually there are telltale signs for that. Like I've talked about this a million times. Like if she suddenly starts to take an interest in like Swedish death metal and lifting heavy weights or, you know, does something sort of out of, you know, has these new hobbies and interests that are really out of character for her. Odds are she's doing that because she's now got a guy that is into Swedish death metal and likes to, you know, lift heavy things. Right. His hobbies become her hobbies. She will find ways to, to be compatible with that guy. That's a, that's a sign. It's a good sign. If, you're involved with that chick and she's has gen, you want to know a genuine desire of you were asking me earlier. That's a, that's definitely a sign. She starts taking on your interests and your hobbies. And she starts watching your sports. She's a, suddenly a golden Knights uh, fan overnight. Like she Raiders. I'm a Raiders fan. Fuck those Niners. I'm now a Raiders fan, right? Because Rolo's into Raiders. So I'm about it. That's a good sign. If you're the dude, it's a bad sign. If you're not the dude, <laughs> it's a red flag. If you're not the dude, Suddenly she's in the gym quite a bit and she's really looking good these days. And it ain't for you. You didn't inspire that. The guy that she's with inspired that. Now, the hard thing to hear is this is once she is involved in that situation, having sex with you and keeping up appearances with you becomes cheating on him. See what I'm saying? So she knows she's uh, she has an inf infidelity, right? She knows she has a relation, committed relationship with you that has a has boundaries. There's a contract. There's an agreement. Whatever it is, close on his end, close on your end. Whatever she knows that, but yet she's fucked this guy. She develops an emotional uh, investment in this guy. So when your wife or your girlfriend suddenly doesn't want to have sex with you anymore, what's the first thing guys say? Well, she's probably fucking somebody. Else. Even women, even with a third party, you know, outside of it, they'll say the same thing. I should probably fucking somebody else. She's not getting it from you. She has no interest in fucking you, but yet she's like keeping up appearances or she's pretending to still be this devoted wife. Odds are she's probably getting fucked from somebody else or wants to get fucked from somebody else. But in this case, what he was just describing a moment ago is if that's the case, if she has sex with a guy, maybe once or twice, gets emotionally invested in him and then continues the relationship, the affair the thought of sleeping with you and fucking you being the, the wife or the husband in this case is seems like being uh, it seems like cheating on the new guy on the, the guy that she's having the affair with. And that's when that's like, I, I think guys on an instinctive level realize when that woman is sort of lackluster in bed or she's just not interested in it, or she's like really kind of, she has the, there'll, there'll be telltale signs, right? Your subconscious will pick up on it. Your instincts will pick up on it first. You know, that's when guys go, I suspect she's cheating. <laughs> well, why? Because she's not fucking me anymore. And she's not having sex with me the way we used to. Yeah. Because she feels like having sex with you is cheating on him. So now the commitment has shifted. The switching has shifted from him or from you to him. And that's why she feels guilty about having sex with you because she's cheating on him by fucking you and still like giving you the appearance that she's emotionally invested and still wants to fuck you if she's fucking you at all. That's why that's hard to hear. A lot of guys have a problem with that. Understanding that like the guy that she's having the affair with is actually now the husband and you're not. And she doesn't want to have anything to do with you, but she has to keep up appearances as long as it takes for her to sort of get out of that relationship. And that's really what he goes into.